Okay, before everything starts, this is freaking insane. Okay? Just, okay. Now, this happens when you leave the game alone for however long you leave the game alone. You know, like, in it's similar to, like, how you can leave Paper Mario alone, and Mario will, like, fall asleep. Stuff like that. Okay, now, look at this. Do you see... Th okay, look. Wait for it. Wait for it. Hang on. Look at that! You see the... That woman's face up here? Wait, hang on. Wait, let's look for it again. Come on. Look at that! Do you know how terrifying that is to, like, leave the game alone for a little bit and then come back later and then find that staring at you down? It's like, holy frick! Where are you? Where did you come from? My TV is haunted. Uh, but anyway, if you move just like that, it'll go away. Anyway, now, um, we're going to do just a little bit of reading before we start. Now, um, men in white, no, Yoshino, no, location, human-shaped stains. The narrow corridor on the other side of the door where I heard the moaning was strung with paper rope, uh, strung with sacred rope and paper. The walls were covered with human-shaped stains. There was a black stain left behind when Yoshino Takigawa vanished. Vanished. Did something happen on those walls as well? Okay, now there's something... Disappearances. How about this? According to Miku's research, Yoshino Takigawa was asleep almost all the time before she disappeared. After the accident, she slept longer and longer hours, and whenever she woke up, she would hum like... hum what sounded like a lullaby. Apparently, the medical community is abuzz with rumors of similar occurrences, hospital patients who disappeared. Is this another of those urban legends? Okay, now, enough of the notebook. I want to read some files, the, some of the things I've been forgetting to read, because I thought they were in the notebook. Okay, now, texts, okay. Yes, memo and shaky hand, already read that. Okay, burnt passport, yeah, yeah. Okay, photos, no. Okay. Well, what? Oh, oh, okay. There's just other ones. Okay. Um, I guess... What am I looking for here? I thought... Let's see, texts? Ah, here we go, vanishings, that's it. Okay, this is from, this is back from when we got the book on the manner of sleep. Okay, according to sources, before dawn yesterday, a mother and daughter who lived in Myojin Village went missing. The missing are Makie Kuzuhara and her daughter Kozue. Yes, since last year, the two have been searching for Kuzuhara's missing husband. The two reportedly wandered into the mountains nearly every day. The informant said says, I hadn't seen them for several days, so I went to visit them. There was no answer, so I went inside, but they were gone. I only saw some black soot-like marks. Similar disappearances are being reported across the area, and some of them calling them, and some are calling them spirited aways. And patient disappears. Okay. On the night of the 9th, a patient disappeared from her ward in Katsuragi Hospital, and the police are currently searching for her. The missing person is the sole survivor of the August plane crash, Yoshino Toki Takigawa, 26. Miss Takigawa had been, um, became emotionally unstable after the accident. She was diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder and hospitalized long-term. The hospital's response to her disappearance went no further than we are investigating the details. Miss Ta Takigawa lost all her family in the accident, and concerns had been in, have been raised about her current whereabouts. There we go. Those are the two I really needed to read, especially the vanishings. Oh, actually, here, let's do this. Camera. Let's go ahead and upgrade our sensitivity, because maybe that will help us charge up faster or whatever. I don't know. Anyway, now let us go to sleep. These develop pictures. If I show them to Miku, she might know something. Okay. Nope, not yet. I'm going to go ahead and show these pictures to Miku, because that's what I want to do. Okay. Now, uh, let's see here. Let's just go ahead and get going out here. Come on. Come on. All right, there we go. Go on in. And now, where are you? Ah, it's a ghost! No. Having trouble sleeping? No, I hadn't gone to sleep. sleep in here with me? Shut up. I can't barely understand you. Okay. Anyway. Ray, you've been working too hard. You should get some rest. Shut up. What can I do for you? Do my work for me, woman. Miku, I was wondering if you could research this photograph for me. That one with the black stains. Thanks. And okay, research this one and with the mass grave. 
Thanks. Understood. I'll let you know if I find anything. Yeah, get back in the kitchen. Make me a sandwich. Anyway. <laughs> I apologize to the female viewers. I kid the female viewers. Okay. Anyway, now let's go ahead and go back to sleep. Oh, and by the way, these are like some of the bravest girls in the world. Man, I if I was in this mansion and everything, I'd be screaming my head off every two seconds. <laughs> Okay, well there was a hint about where we needed to go. You remember that room with the peephole and the little the little girl with the hammer in there? We need to head back there. This place is The Subduing Song. Oh, and by the way, for those wondering about the pace of the game, we are kind of going through the game very quickly. I'm surprised we're already up to hour three. But for those worrying about the length of the game... Oh, frickin' jeez! Whoa, whoa. Jeez. Aha, we do charge faster with sensitivity. Screw you! Suck it. Ugh. Okay. For those of you wondering about the pace of the game, um, you don't need to worry, because while we're already in hour three in just five freaking episodes, um, there's a total of 12 hours. So this isn't going to be like a super short LP, for those of you that are possibly worrying about that. Okay. So I got an item right there. Now, right here, this is very difficult to see. Uh, normally you don't take this shot from here, you take it from closer. But I'm gonna take it from here just to make sure I get it. Come on. Come on, I know it. There, got it. Now, if you get too close to that, it goes away. But if you take it from further away, it doesn't do anything. It's impossible to get after you come close, though. Right, type 61 film. So that is an upgraded kind of film. And where we get 10 type 14 with every drop, we get 8 type 61s. So, yeah. Anyway, let's go in down here. I'll show you the little thing. Did you see that? There was like an arm coming out from there. Uh, maybe I went in the camera viewpoint a little bit at the wrong time. Sorry, but hopefully you guys could still see it. Anyway, um, this is that room that we were in where we took a picture of the guy standing right here, if you remember. Um, come on, let's go. No, come on, stop, jeez. Okay, now, uh, let's go ahead and back through this area, because I want to check this area where this girl was, because I know we need to go there. Okay. Yay! Open the lock. And now we have um, this door open so we can explore, we can get back here much easier. Because as you can see, we're back here in this main room where we fought that uh, woman and her daughter. Could they be the same woman and daughter from that letter? Oh, there's something here. I think. Yeah, there's something here. I know what this is. Okay. Go ahead and come back here and get another thing of herbal medicine. Because you can get this every single time. Don't forget that. And it's very, very helpful to save up on those things. Okay. Alright, now listen carefully. You hear that sound? That is the sound of uh, a girl crying up here. So we need to come up here. And... There she is, back there. Daddy, I, I... Whoa! 
I forgot you have to fight her. Jeez. Oh, crap, I hate this. Whoa. Jeez. Ah, there you are. Oh, dang it. Whoa. Hi. What's up? Okay, now... Ugh. These are some of the worst kinds of ghosts in the entire series. Child ghosts are always incredibly difficult to fight. Because they just appear like that. Thank you, Fatal Frame. Somehow. Don't know how much damage that was, but... You're sorry, stop attacking me. Hi. Ah, jeez, go away. There you are. At least I'm getting fatal frames on her. Okay, so the way you want to fight her is watch out for her when she is coming around. Whoa! Coming around like that, and then move quickly to dodge that. Dang it, I missed it. Okay, are you gonna die soon, or what? Where are you? Come on. Whoa, did it, whoa! Jeez, did it have to go super dark? Oh, this is so not necessary. Ah, uh, don't do that. It is kind of really, really sad to have to do that to a little girl that, you know, basically lost her father, but... <sighs> I really, really hate fighting children. Not because I'm, like, so against child violence. It's just that, well, I am against child violence. Don't get me wrong. But here, let me say this. Let me just rephrase this. I hate fighting child ghosts in this game. There. That's much better. <laughs> wow. But, yeah. Watch out for child ghosts. They are very, very difficult to fight because they are tiny. And the thing that they just have a fetish for is just appearing right next to you like they disappear and they will appear right behind you and they'll attack you just right oh hello hi woman oh hey got a photo okay oh I thought I was gonna have to fight her okay uh, anyway at least I can get some film here that'll be nice because I used a lot on that girl um, now, as you can see, and as you have been seeing, probably, as you fight ghosts, just regular fighting ghosts, you get uh, points. So you don't just get points from getting ghosts that um, stand... Uh, you... You... Okay. You, you don't get... You don't just get points from ghosts that do nothing but stand there. You get points from hostile ghosts as well. Oh, great. Now I hear her crying again. Okay, well, I think I remember where she is in here, too. Oh, uh, am I even going the right way? Where am I going? Oh, I... I think I'm going the wrong way. Dang it. I did go the wrong way. She's obviously up here. Where is she? I think I'm like right on top of her. There! Holy crap! How did I miss her? 
Daddy's dead. <sighs> this game scares me. This game sucks, but it's so good. Okay. So that's how you can get some extra points if you need them. Um, let's go ahead and come back down here because I went the wrong way. I should not have come this way. Um, I just forgot exactly where we need to go. And there is a map in the game. So if you do get lost, let me see. Uh, there we go. Press L2. And this is the map. So the blue rooms are ones that you've been in. And... Uh, I believe the gray rooms are things that, you know, you haven't been on. Or in, or whatever, you know. So, the, the, there's the map. So, <laughs> although I kind of know... Oh! Um. What? Hey, I took that picture! How come I didn't get any... How come I didn't get anything for it? That's not fair. I took that picture. Ah, oh, whatever. Anyway. Now let's go ahead and head on back here. Now, um, one goal that I have in mind with this Let's Play is to finish it... Well, I really would love to finish this Let's Play on Halloween night. That would be amazing. That would be so cool if I could do that. But... Anyway, I think I'm going to end this video off soon because um, we're getting close to where that little girl was, you know, in that room. And depending on what happens there, I might just end it off here. I mean, I, I, not not right here, but, you know, as soon as we do whatever, whatever happens there. Okay. So, let's get on in here. Anything there? Nope. Good. <laughs> Is there anything in there? Nope. Okay. Alright. Now, go ahead and look through the peephole. Is there anything there? Well, I mean, didn't they want us to come here? What the heck? Oh, come on! Well, I guess maybe that I, I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking... Maybe it showed a different room. Who knows? Maybe I just got it wrong. Okay. Well, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video off here. Sorry to end it on such like a, like a disappointing note. Kind of like with nothing at all happening. But I guess that's just the way it goes sometimes when you don't remember exactly what you have to do. But anyway, I will see you guys next time where we do a little bit more of this game. So, anyway, I will go ahead and see you guys next time.